Hi guys, my name is Lee and I want to tell you about my eyes. I have astigmatism and that, as far as I've read, uh, that may be caused by unequal eye muscles in your eye which can cause a distortion, uh, unequal tension in your uh, cornea. So I figured this is why I have astigmatism it's as far as I extrapolated from my uh, research. So. I have uh, these, my prescription on uh, my cylinders are uh, for the contacts are negative 2.25 and negative 1.75. Those are on the upper end of the moderate uh, scale of uh, uh, astigmatism. So um, I've always worn glasses and now that I got these, now I was researching Lasix and apparently I'm not sure if I'm qualified yet I'll know on Friday but I'm pretty sure it's gonna it would work for me but then I thought well uh, maybe for now I could do cataract um, eye exercises right so I didn't believe my eye doctor when they're telling me pencil push-ups and it seems like that is a trick that uh, over time if you keep doing them you know daily that you would uh, end up with a uh, good eye muscles to um, relieve the tension and because uh, my problem is is that not only do I have astigmatism I have strabismus and it was more pronounced earlier in my life but I think since the advent of uh, cell phones and my tablet uh, I've been converging my eyes more so my problems are uh, muscles that are in this area right here are weak and I believe that's hereditary because my dad had the same thing in his pictures his eyes a little off you can't really tell so that's the same reason when uh, people tell me like uh, I ask them do you see my uh, eye muscle and or do you see my eyes uh, drifting and most of them say I haven't noticed it until you told me but some keen people who may have seen me when I'm tired uh, tell me that that was the first thing they saw uh, but as I said, as I'm saying, it's more pronounced when I'm just waking up, when I'm tired, when I'm straining, when I'm stressed, when I'm really high on caffeine, or when I'm, you know, uh, well, maybe maybe the opposite, when I'm getting off of caffeine, uh, I just start to lose it. So, uh, long story short, uh, I have contacts now. I'm considering Lasix, and I'm doing a lot more eye muscle training. So that's where I made this thing. Uh, it's just a stick with the with orange cap and I got some tape taped around the sides like this. So I kind of line it up like that and I go in, out, in, all the way out, right? And I focus in and then once I see double, which is pretty near, I hold it there and then I bring it out. But that's not my problem. My problem is up here because when I'm looking over here, I when I'm showing a, when I'm looking when I look at myself through the camera, my eye will kind of readjust like it's, it sees it and then it'll, it'll move. This one eye will move all by itself. This will keep locking. This will will find its place. It's really weird. So this eye is fucked. So I have to do a lot of exercising this way and this way. And this is where I just learned. That, I mean, I've heard of this stuff before, but I'm trying to keep in focus like this. And if I use enough willpower, I could keep the thing from splitting. Now that leads me to my next point, is that the Oculus Rift. Apparently, there's this guy named uh, uh, Blah. I don't forgot his first name. Uh, James Blah and he's created a game from the Oculus Rift for people with strabismus that have a much more uh, severe cases that are really out there and it's um, he does a contrasting uh, he makes one eye the dominant eye darker in contrast and makes the weaker eye more brighter and then he has a game inside the virtual reality headset the Oculus Rift where you're hitting balls in different corners of the screen and you're just like tracking it 
and eventually uh, apparently uh, first few times using it he starts knocking uh, people start having 3d vision now I have 3d vision but uh, when I'm walking down a hall and look up at somebody my eye will kind of this eye as you can see that's what happens and that could happen too but I can keep it straight but it hurts so I don't know what to think about it it's and I think that is causing the stigmatism and I think this eye muscle thing is hereditary so my options I think the best thing for me to do is LASIX and then I then the oculus rift training along with muscle surgery I don't know I don't know I think I would go I mean right now the other two things are very expensive surgeries so right now I'm just gonna go contacts and I'm gonna get the oculus rift and I'm gonna keep doing these pencil trainings until that machine comes out the, and I'm gonna build a PC and get it ready and jump into virtual reality and fix my eyes so um, hope you enjoyed this video that's some information about me and my eyes maybe you got the same thing let me know take care